Um, oh yeah, this is Chanel. And get this is Chanel. <laughs> Hey babes, welcome or welcome back to another vlog. At this point, we ain't gonna call it Vlogmas, baby. Baby, we ain't gonna call it Vlogmas because we already missed about mm, five, six days in a row. <laughs> but who's counting? Who's counting? Anyways, today's Thursday. Little life update for y'all. Your girl has been chasing the bag. I've been chasing the check. So, yeah, I know I started a new job. And I've been working, like, literally almost every single day. Monday through Friday, on my work every day. And then, like, I have off on Saturdays. And my job isn't even open on Sundays anyway. So, like, only time I have, like, real free time is on Saturdays and Sundays. And I just, like, don't want to vlog because... Like, I do, but then, like, at the same time, I don't because I'm really just trying to enjoy my day off without, like, feeling like I have to be doing something, you know? Because if I'm at work every single day, and, like, most days I work, um, 5 a.m., 5.30 a.m., or, like, 6 a.m., and I'll be out at 2. And then after work, I literally don't be doing nothing, but, like, I'll be in the house, and I don't want to keep just vlogging, like, me being in the house, in my room, in the same chair, because that's boring to me, so... I don't know. I just be trying to put out better content. Like I was a record vlogging a little bit every day, like the past week. But like I literally just looked at the footage, and I scrapped all of it. I deleted all of it because I was like, this is so, like shitty. Like it's shitty. I'm like, no. Like I'm not even gonna do like that. I I don't want to just put out anything just for the hell of it. So we gonna try this again. So today's Thursday. So I'm gonna try to do like a little weekend vlog. Like I said. Vlogmas, y'all. Look, we went strong for about eight days, okay? I don't have nothing else to say, like. <laughs> Girl, Vlogmas is freaking hard. Well, it's not even the fact that it's hard. It's that that's not, it's not my only job. Like, I have a, you know, a real job. So, like, when you have a real job and you work, you know, like, 45 hours a week, 40, 45 hours a week, baby, ain't nobody trying to come home and, and record a video, edit a video up. Tag. but it's thursday i work today um 5 30 to 2 so i was at work for eight and a half hours and um came home i got home around like 2 15 and i literally yeah i took my wig off and then like i washed my wig um and like reinstalled it and stuff and freshened it up because girl work we have my hair looking a mess all week because i just be like throwing like a headband on like a hat and like my lace kind of be like lifting up and like my edges being messed up and it's just be a hot mess so tomorrow's friday so you know i'm gonna do like a little weekend vlog or whatever and um just bring it along with me for the weekend and um probably try to film like some other videos and stuff this weekend um i know i still want to film my night routine i still want to film my morning routine um and i also did have some other videos planned for vlogmas but we don't know if it's gonna make it for vlogmas we don't know if it's gonna make it but <laughs> we'll see um i'm still in the process of like redecorating my room hence why i still have this comforter set right here that's been sitting on my bed at, at, at the end of my bed for about two weeks now like i'm still just trying to figure out like you know life and you know just get this get this mental right because once i can get my mental right then i think everything else will kind of fall in line anyways y'all i'm chatting like i said i did my hair um i'm in the process of like flat 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 ironing it not flat ironing it i mean hot combing it down just to get it look flat and stuff and like fix my part and then i'm gonna do my lashes and i was gonna put my nails on now i don't know if i'm gonna wear with these y'all because you know my job they be like oh, you can't wear nails you can't wear nails to work, man. Stop playing with me, because y'all really hate me. Like, they really just want you to look mad ugly at work, right? Why are y'all playing with me? But tomorrow I work 10 to 6, and I really don't like those hours because literally, who wants to get out of work at 6 o'clock? Like, the, the whole damn day is done. And I'd be like, can y'all just stop putting me on a schedule? Like, on Fridays, they be putting me on a 10 to 6. I don't want to work from 10 to six i don't want to get out of work at six o'clock the sun be down at four why am i getting like mm -mm. and then on friday like 
why y'all want to come to chick-fil-a like go somewhere else i always still try to like look my best every day like even if i know i'm like whatever i'm just going to work like girl i still want to be cute because look when you look good you feel good at least for me when i look good i feel good i feel like i can be nicer to people <laughs> like i don't have an attitude at being at work like if i know i look cute then i don't mind you know like if i know i look a mess and i'm just gonna be like i just need to hurry up and get in and get out and i want to go home and i don't want to be here type stuff you know what i mean so i try to look cute it makes me feel better when i look cute just don't be walking around looking homeless like <laughs> you have a home you got money you have transportation so there's no reason for you to be looking the complete opposite like if that makes sense get the hot comb and like press it out one more time just to make sure it's flat y'all because i told y'all i don't do them bulky wigs that look like helmets then it's already like hella smooth like look how flat that is like this is giving scalp obviously it's still really puffy but i don't think i'm going to style my hair tonight because i go to work tomorrow so it don't make sense to me to style it tonight but what i'm gonna do in the morning is it's gonna be like really cute and like defined and curly and stuff i'm going to wet it this is what i'm gonna do just in case i forget to show y'all in the morning i'm gonna wet it with this water bottle just regular water i'm gonna use this foam wrap mousse and then i'm going to use and then i'm going to use my coily custard that's what it's called it's gonna look like this my miss jet miss jesse's coily custard y'all these three in that order curls be so 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 popping and so cute we got it all figured out now and i'm gonna be so cute at work i just can't wait because i just yeah period like i love looking good i love smelling good i just love all of that for me y'all my freaking arms itch and my skin is so dry i didn't put on no lotion today so i can't wait to like get in the shower and like moisturize my body because i need it but i'm about to just brush this hair out and put it in braids so like definitely comment down below and let me know who y'all watching for vlogmas Honestly, I haven't really been, like, too into everybody's vlogmas because I feel like a lot of it is, like, mad repetitive and boring. Like, I think most people, when they do vlogmas, they literally just do straight vlogs. For me, like, my idea of vlogmas, doing vlogs every single day isn't really realistic for me, personally, because I know I don't want to vlog every single day. And, like, even if I did vlog every single day, I don't have anything valuable enough in my opinion to show you that i'm vlogging you know so when i do vlogmas i like to you know do other content like you know like my routines or like um you know perfume like i did my most complimented perfume and then i still wanted to do my lashes because my eyes is giving very much bald that is probably one of my biggest pet peeves that's probably the quickest way to like turn me off or like turn me away like because why the fuck did you text me and i literally text you right back right back and it takes 25 years for me to get a reply when you texted me but let somebody text me though and i take a long time to reply and when i finally reply then they want to text me back like but if i never but if I never took that long to reply and reply right back to you, then you would have took that long. So it's like, I'm just about to stop texting y'all back all together. Like, nobody's going to hear from me is what it's going to be. Since y'all can't do right. So, boom. We look a little crazy right now, y'all. But, you know, trust. You have to trust this process, okay? So, lace is still melting. I know I don't play when it comes to my lace. Now I'm about to do my lashes. These are the lashes that I get. They're the I May um, individual lashes. I get a C curl. Um, I usually get like a couple different lengths. These are 13s, but the 13s are almost gone. I have 14s and then I have 15s. But I do have like three more packs of 15, 13s coming because I like 13s the best. I think they just fit like my eye shape the best. When are they coming though? Because I think they were supposed to be here. Uh, let me check because i get my lashes from amazon i will link them tomorrow i mean i'll link them why am i saying i'll link them tomorrow i'll link them in the description box down below so it says 
shipped. One is shipped and coming tomorrow. Another one is coming Saturday. Oh no. So two are coming Saturday and one is coming tomorrow. So yeah, and I literally ordered that like Monday. <laughs> so yeah, you know Amazon Prime don't be really giving Amazon Prime because baby why is it taking five six days for me to get my shit like y'all said it was prime it's supposed to be two days and i'm waiting a week so these are the 14 they look like this um i did like a little tutorial on my lashes before so i'm not gonna be going through all that again all right y'all so my lashes are done this is what they look like they're so cute this is um 14 like I said, I have 13s coming, but it's fine. Um, anyways, I'm probably gonna shower. It's 906. I'm probably gonna shower, exfoliate, um, my body care, all of that. And while I'm gonna shower, I'm gonna leave this band on. I don't usually like leaving my band on. You know what? I actually might not because no, I will. Because the steam. I don't want to mess up my hair. I usually don't leave it on because it gives me a headache. But I am going to leave it on. Because I'm about to get in a shower. And I know I'm going to be in a shower probably for a long time. So I'm going to leave the band on. So I'm about to tie my hair up and stuff. And Well, I'm not going to tie it up. I'm just going to put the bonnet on to shower. So when I get out the shower, I'm going to show y'all. Um, Hopefully I remember. I'm going to show y'all all the products that I use. Because I got some new stuff from Bath & Body Works. So I'm going to show y'all everything, but let me hurry up and get in the shower so I can get in bed because I'm just trying to unwind now and I'm trying to chill. Alright y'all, so I'm out to show you and everything, moisturize, and I want to show y'all everything that I use because I smell so good and my skin feels so soft. So I use my Fenty Skin Body Butter. Y'all, this, oh my god, I have to go back and get the, hold on. I have to go back and get the big, um, the big one. But y'all, the texture though. Let me see if my camera will focus. The texture, y'all, it's literally butter. Like butter. It feels amazing. It smells. It smells so good. Like <laughs> it literally smells so good. So this is the 2.5 fluid ounce. This one was like $20. And I think it was like $18. Um, Sephora had a 20% off sale. But I think I'm going to get the big one. Which is like $40. When this one runs out. Because it's so good. Like it's so good. But like I won't use this every day. But like on those nights where I want that extra self care and I want my skin to feel so smooth and buttery. You just want that extra like glow, moisture and glisten. Yeah, she's that girl. So Rihanna, baby, you did that. By no surprise. Next, I use my Nivea. So for the body butter, I only use it like on my neck and chest and like kind of like my shoulder area. I'm not gonna like slather all of this on my arms and legs because that would just be using like the whole damn the whole damn thing would be gone <laughs> if I did that so I use my Nivea and then I just use my bio oil and if you don't know nothing about bio oil it's really good for like scars stretch marks um, hyperpigmentation uneven skin tone anything like that a little bit definitely does go a long way so I love my bio oil to just rub all over my legs and my um thighs and you know anywhere like that and then for deodorant i'm using my dove advanced care this is the carrying coconut one it smells super good and just fresh really clean and yeah all of these products just got me smelling real fresh real clean and then i did spray some perfume i sprayed my chanel mademoiselle so all the products that i showed you i will link everything in the description box down below y'all i highly recommend getting the fancy skin like it's a little pricey but in my opinion i don't think it's that bad because you can get the smaller one or you can also get the bigger one and this isn't something that you can you use like every single day like if you want to by all means or do what you want to do but like 
Yeah, I know I work every day, so every day I'm not about to be throwing on pinty skin to go to work. For what? Like, for what? So, like, that's why I have, like, my other body butters. And I'm also going to show y'all the other body butters that I use and, like, just switch out and alter me and stuff like that. All right, so I guess this is turning into, like, a body butter haul or whatever. But the other one that I use is the Brazilian Bum Bum Cream. I'm sure you guys have seen this one before. I really do love this one. It smells super, super, super duper good. Um, also, these two from Beth and Body Works smell so good. I re-upped on this one from the Bath and Body Works body care sale. They had like all body care was $5.50. So you know I had to re-up and I bought one of these and um, another one of them. But this one I had since like over the summer. You can see like I really be using this y'all and it smells so good. Like this is something that I would just use like on a daily. Like if I'm going to work and I want to you know my body get out extra because it's like cheaper. So, I think this big one was like $18 regular price, but it's big and it's like, how many ounces? Eight ounces. So, I think the Fenty Skin, this two ounce was $18. So, just think about the comparison and size and stuff. Like, the full size of the Fenty Skin is like $40 and I don't even know if it's eight ounces or not. So, yeah. <laughs> But this is definitely something that I reach for all the time. It smells so good. Hence why I had to get another one. It has um, coconut water and vitamin E. Top tier. She's that girl. Um, this one, y'all yeah, know this is like my all time. So good. This is my second jar. And it's actually almost empty again. Um, this is the Righteous Butter from Soap and Glory. Y'all, yeah, this is just she's that girl so like if y'all looking for like thick creamy butters that would really keep your skin moisturized like you know especially during like our drier months in the winter time and stuff when it's like cold outside because i know for me i already have dry skin so like i cannot not put on lotion like my skin will be screaming if i don't wear lotion or like some type of body butter or something plus i really just love to smell good so if you want to be moisturized and you like thick creamy products that smell good that lasts all day Definitely, these two from Bath and Body Works. This I got from Target, and I'll link everything in the description box down below. So, yeah. But anyways, y'all, I'm about to get ready to go to sleep. I take my melatonin, wrap my hair, tie my hair up, probably watch some Netflix. It's 10:15, and I'll probably KO soon, cause I wanna wake up at like 8:30 tomorrow. Make me some breakfast, and you know, take my time, and you know collect myself before I go to work so I will pick up the camera tomorrow all right y'all it's the next morning currently nine o'clock on the dot actually nine o'clock in the morning I um I woke up at eight I didn't get out of bed till 8 30 I was on TikTok not good um made breakfast I'm eating Sorry, I gotta brush my lashes because they, they look a little crazy on camera. <laughs> um, I made blueberry. Can y'all see? Ooh, my fork about to slide off my plate. Blueberry waffles and turkey bacon. And I got some orange juice. Extra pulp with ice. Do y'all like pulp in your orange juice? Because I love pulp. You do like, oh, pulp is nasty. No. Pulp is good, like, and that's where all of the nutrition and stuff is at in the pulp, so. Mm -hmm. I'm going to eat my food. It's 9 o'clock, and then take a quick shower and get ready to go to work. I just be trying to enjoy a little bit of my life before I clock in. <laughs> So, I'm going to a shower, do my little body care. I love when I go to work and people be telling me I smell good. I'm like, oh, and I have. Um, oh, you smell good. What is that? Mm, now your perfume smells so good. Like, I know. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. This is Chanel. Again, this is Chanel. 
<laughs> I'm weak. Next year, is that building my perfume collection is going to be like one of my main focuses. I want to get Baccarat, but that shit is so expensive. What is the retail price for Baccarat Rouge 540 perfume? Okay. I found this on the web for what is the retail price for Baccarat Rouge 540 perfume. Check it out. Let's see, y'all. Uh, what these prices are looking like? The 35 milliliter is $195. <laughs> um, the 70 milliliter, $325. And the 200 milliliter, y'all, yeah, $625. Bye. Goodbye and good night. Because it ain't no way. It ain't no way, boy. It ain't no way. Wait, let me make sure because that website didn't look accurate. Oh, I'm just going to go on Saks. Okay, hold on. <clears throat> okay, so there's a perfume and then there's like an extract. So the extract is more money because it's like more oils. It's more concentrated. So it's stronger. But the Ude Parfum starts off 2.4 ounce is 325. And a 6.8 ounce, which is a lot of perfume. That's a lot. Is 625. But who the hell needs 6 and an 6.8 almost 7 ounces of perfume and I don't know if, if y'all realize like that's a lot like that's a big bottle 6.8 ounces damn but 195 for a one, a one ounce that shit is too expensive what I should must have you smell like a bag of money if I'm spending 625 almost 700 dollars might as say 700 dollars after taxes and everything on perfume Mm -mm. I wouldn't even tell nobody what I'm wearing. Like, I mean, you can always get like a payment, like do the payment plan or whatever. But who about to be still doing that? Mm -mm. I also heard Gentle Fluidity. Fluidity is good by him as well. His name is Mason. Mason? Is that Mason Francis? I'm not even finna botch his last name. But y'all know who I'm talking about. The man who made Baccarat, all of his perfumes. The Gentle Fluidity. I heard it's good and it's actually cheaper. I know he getting himself a bag though. Anyway, let me eat my food. Hurry up because it's 9, 9.09. I'm going to leave the house at like 9.40. So that means I got like 30 minutes so, to shower and get my shit together. So I'll be back. All right, yeah, I'm out to shower. It's 5.36. Try to leave the house by like 5:45. When am I not rushing though? Like that's my problem. Like I literally, I can wake up three hours in advance and still be rushing. When it's like, I don't know what it is about me that I just can't. We can't be on time ever. Well, we're gonna be on time, but we gonna come right on the dot. Like. <laughs> So, back from work, it's currently, hold on, my camera not straight, whatever, okay, it's currently almost 7 o'clock, I've been home since like 6.15, and 
and I've just been like sitting here on TikTok, stretching, just, uh, just kind of like sitting around because I've been standing up all day and I'm freaking tired. But I have off tomorrow, Saturday, and Sunday. So, yeah. I'm chilling. I'm about to find, see if I can find something to eat. And, oof, my head itch. Okay, I'll probably see if I can find me something to eat. Take a nice shower. A nice hot shower because I've been standing outside taking orders all day on the iPads for drive through. So I'm like cold. My feet are freezing. And, and I'm going to take me in like a hot shower. What else? I figure out what I'm going to eat for dinner. And I just go to sleep because it's Friday. I don't have plans. I don't. Yeah, I really don't have no life. Like, that's why I really don't be vlogging because it's like, what am I vlogging? I'm literally at work every day. <laughs> like, every single day, y'all. Alright, so. Honestly, I don't know what I'm gonna eat for dinner. So, I guess we're about to find out. Right now. Yeah, these granola bars, they be mad good. It's a yogurt, strawberry yogurt, granola bars. They're so good. All right, y'all. So, I made some hot chocolate. Oop, and I literally almost spilled it, but... I put whipped cream. Obviously, you can't see it now because it melted. And I put chocolate drizzle and caramel drizzle. Oh, now let me see. I can show y'all. Y'all see it? Yeah, y'all see it. So, I'm going to get in my bed and just chill out. And I got to make this invitation for my friend. And, like, watch YouTube and just chill. Y'all, like, I don't be doing that. And then, like, after that... Um, I don't know, probably in the shower, just chill, <laughs> like, yeah, so, if I do anything else that is eventful, I will be sure to let you guys know, but I don't have nothing to talk about right now, mmm, good morning y'all, it's the next day, well it's actually not morning anymore, it's 1.22pm, I've been up since like 10 o'clock. Um, today's Saturday, so it's my day off. So, you know, I just decided to sleep in and not like, you know, put so much pressure on me waking up early because literally the schedule just came out for next week, y'all. And this is where I'd be so damn tired and I can't post no damn YouTube videos because girl, I'd be tired. Work every single day. So, 40 hours. If y'all don't believe me, let me show y'all right now. Let me try to cover. Okay, I'm just going to screenshot and like crop it so nobody can like see the all of the details because yeah i don't need that but like okay let me show y'all because your girl really worked 40 hours okay so boom let's focus it as you can see at the top it says schedule hours 40 sunday december 19th which is tomorrow is closed the store is closed so obviously nobody works december 20th 6 a.m to 2 6 a.m to 2 6 a.m to 2, 6 a.m. To 2. December 23rd, hold on, 6 a.m. to 2, December 24th, Christmas Eve, 9 to 5. I think we close at, I think we're only open from 10 to 6 anyways on Christmas Eve, because Chick-fil-A, yeah, I think they close early anyway, so they, the store closes at 6, but like, I still have to work, sorry, my camera wasn't focused, like, I still have to work, your girl work every day, I work 8 hours every day, 40 hours a week, I'll be tired, y'all, like, <laughs> so you know i'm getting to the bag getting to the bag 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 give me my bag you feel me you feel me i mean like do you really feel me though like because yeah because yeah 
so I am about to do my skincare. I just got out of the shower. I do my little skincare routine. I don't like filming like a TikTok or whatever. My edges like on this side it itches so bad. I'm trying not to scratch it because I know when I scratch it it makes my frontal lift. But oh my god, it's like so itchy. <laughs> so I do my little skincare routine or whatever. Some of my lashes fell out on this eye. But you know what? Sometimes I like the sparse look. Like sometimes I don't like them to look like right, super duper full. Is it just me? Like, I feel like sometimes when your lashes start falling out, they look cuter. And I was thinking about doing my makeup today. I'm like, I don't know if I really want to. Mm. So, that's where I'm at right now. I don't really have much plan. Today, Bath & Body Works has the candle sale for $12.95. So, I kind of wanted to go to Bath & Body Works and... I don't know if y'all know, but, like, if you have, like, empty candles from Bath & Body Works that you use, they'll let you bring it back and swap it for a new one if you bring back the container. So, I have, like, three empty candles that I was going to, like, swap back so I can get, like, new candles. Mmm, skin looking right. Skin looking tight. Mmm, skin looking right. Skin looking tight. Yeah. Respectfully, I take a lot of pride in my skin. A lot of pride. I should be looking good. Okay. Put on some Listex and then I'm gonna put on some of this Tree Hut lip gloss. I gotta delete some stuff. Alright, y'all. I had to delete some stuff off my memory card because it was too much. But I was saying I put the Blissex on first and I used my, ooh, my Tree Hut lip butter. This tree hut lip butter it's like kind of has like sugar um pieces in it and it like exfoliates your lips this is what it looks like if y'all want to go get one i got it from target i think it was like six dollars so that is like a little expensive but whatever um but yeah i feel like this is to making my lips hella hella soft and just moisturize like hello okay so let me take this off i don't know what i'm gonna do with my hair today or if i'm gonna do my makeup today or not because i'm still like in the middle right. i'm gonna finish making my tiktok get myself together figure out what i'm gonna do and then i'm gonna be back all right y'all so i did my body hair <laughs> feels so good my skin feels amazing now i'm going to do my nails and my toes I'm going to paint my toes white. And I'm going to do... No, okay, so it depends. Either... Because I have some French toenails that I used once. But I don't know if I still have um, a size for every toe. So I'm going to try to size them up to see if I have enough for each toe. So if I have enough, then I'm going to put those on. But if I don't, then I'm just going to paint my toes white. And then I have these French on nails you know i'm good for a good french set we're good for a good french set so i'm gonna do my nails i'm gonna do my toes first because i don't want to mess my nails up i got this little like drill from family dollar for six dollars and it came with like all these different like bits and stuff and of course my camera is dying so that's annoying i'm gonna charge my camera battery but i'm gonna show y'all real quick this is the drill it was six dollars and um it came with all these little bits and stuff so i'll be like filing my nails and my toes and make sure the shape is good and all of that stuff so i'm gonna do my nails and my toes and then i'm gonna come back i'm gonna let my camera battery charge and i'm gonna come back and show y'all everything so we'll be back all right y'all so i'm back it's been about two or three hours i was doing my nails and toes for literally like two hours because i was just really trying to take my time and make sure you know everything looked nice and i just like taking my time when i do like my self-care days and stuff because i don't want to rush i want to you know 
make sure it's nice and neat and pretty and I like to file my nails I like them to look a certain way I'm just very particular and specific with my nails and my toes and just myself in general so here's the nails get into it ignore this scar on my finger is literally sending me into a deep hole that I just hate it so much I've been using like my bio oil and my um my cocoa butter stick this is my cocoa butter stick and I've been using my bio oil but it's just it's still so fresh like it's only like two or three weeks old so like you're gonna still see it but like I can't wait till it goes away because it's it's just not cute so these are my nails anyway I kind of cut myself right there that's why it's kind of bleeding but whatever and yeah super cute basic Frenchies yeah, I know I love Frenchies like you can just never go wrong super classy it's cute and it matches everything it's my aesthetic like I'm so big on like aesthetic and like like it has to match my vibe and I don't like nothing too loud too out there too crazy um real short cute manageable I can still do my job and yeah really cute love them love that for me and then my toes this might be kind of weird me showing y'all my feet but whatever let me show y'all my toes oh whatever so they so cute so these are my feet y'all can see cute little like frenchy situation it matches so really cute i love that so now i'm about to just try to find something to eat because i haven't eaten anything since breakfast so it's 4:44. oh look my angel numbers i always catch 444 this is just like so refreshing and you know reassuring because i always catch 444 i might get that tidy actually i was thinking about that but um yeah i i'm going to find something to eat figure that out and yeah i don't know what i'm gonna eat for lunch so I don't really feel like cooking, so I was like, maybe I'll just make like a smoothie, but I know that's not like real food, because I really don't be eating like real food. I literally just be drinking iced coffee, smoothies, maybe some fruit here and there, or like a salad, because y'all you know, like, I don't know if, did I tell y'all that in this vlog? I don't remember, but like, I've been trying to be on like this whole like health kick and like, you know, just eat a little bit more cleaner. I'm not on a like diet or nothing crazy, but... <clears throat> I'm working towards just becoming a better me, taking my vitamins every day. Oh, which I forgot. Listen, I'm going to take them out because I have to take my vitamins. But I don't like taking them on an empty stomach because if I take them on an empty stomach, they make me nauseous. So after I eat, I'm going to take those. I'm going to have to take those out. So I remember. But yeah, like I've just been trying to like take my vitamins, eat a little bit cleaner, you know, make sure I'm having my fruits, my veggies. And, um, and as a new year comes in i can get myself in a better routine with like work and stuff i want to try to do like um just like little workouts every day here and there i'm not going to like put too much pressure on myself but i do want to work out at least like you know like three times a week or you know on the weekends just here and there like maybe i just want to like try to get a workout in um just to keep my body alive and moving and just you know i want to just build better habits new habits um so then like things that just come natural you know it's like an instinct to do things like a routine it doesn't feel like a task if you like build those habits um early on and then like later on in life it's like it's second nature to you to want to do those things so you know i just turned 20 so you know i'll be 21 in july and well, how many months away is that july is seven months away my birthday so you know by the time i turn 21 i want to just be like just all around in a better space mentally physically um and just you know just better things new things change is good so that's what i'm working on anyways yeah i'm about to figure out what i'm gonna eat because i don't know I kind of want a smoothie though, but I know every time I eat a smoothie, because I use like blueberries and strawberries, 
the seeds get stuck all in my teeth and that is so annoying because I always have to like brush my teeth <laughs> and like rinse my mouth after I eat a smoothie because it'd be like the black seeds and stuff be like all in my teeth and it's disgusting but like I really feel like I want a smoothie right now maybe I'll make like some eggs and toast because we don't have no salad here all right y'all I'm gonna fix my camera. I'm back and I made tuna melts. My tuna melts would be so good. Like, I put <clears throat> to make my tuna, I mix mayo, mustard, but we didn't have regular mustard, so I put honey mustard. But I only put a little bit and I season with um, seasoned salt, pepper, a little bit of paprika for like color. And I put um, banana peppers, hot banana peppers, and then like cheese. And then I um, put mayo on the bread and then like toast it and butter on the stove. And it's really good. So I made two of them. Mm -mm -mm. So I'm just about to eat this and probably drink some water. And then later on if I get hungry again. Or I don't know if I want to cook or not. So... I'm debating on if I want to do like a sweet potato and like a steak. Only thing with sweet potato, like I would have to throw, throw that in the oven now because it takes like an hour and a half to bake. And it's 5.15 so I probably will throw it in the oven after I'm done eating this. So like for dinner because this is just like a snack, you know. And then I'll probably like make a steak with it. So I'll let y'all know. But I might just chill right now. I just watched something on TV. Drink some water. I'm gonna take my vitamins. I showed y'all my vitamins already in other vlogs. I just take the one a day. They look like this. One a day, women's vitamins. And I take cranberry supplements. But if you don't want to take the cranberry supplements, you can literally just drink apple juice. I mean, not apple juice, <laughs> cranberry juice. <clears throat> what y'all also drink, so... It's up to you, but it's good for, like, vitamin C and, like, you know, woman's health. So, I'm about to eat, and I'll get back to y'all later. Alright, y'all. So, I'm back. Um, I made my tuna melts. I only ate one of them. I got full up the first one because it was, like, tuna is, like, high in protein. It's very filling to me. And, like, with the bread, I had put peppers on it. And it was, like, a little bit of cheese on it. So, I was, like, yeah, that's enough for me. <laughs> so, I only ate one. I gave the other one to my mom. I feel like my camera is looking a little too bright. Okay. <clears throat> um, I poured some. I have my water right here, and I poured some cranberry juice right here. I'm about to take my vitamins. Now, really, I don't have to take my cranberry vitamins because I literally I'm drinking cranberry juice, and even on a the container it says one serving equals one glass of cranberry juice so i'm like do i really need to do that you yeah, see right there it says one serving equals one glass of cranberry juice so i'm like is that really necessary mm -hmm. i don't know and then these one a day, yeah, I'm kind of dreading doing this. I think I'm going to cut it in half because, y'all, these be trying to take up out because they are so big. So, see, I cut it in half and take it like that or don't take it out. <laughs> okay, it's actually not that bad when I break it in half. So, I think from now on, I just have to break it in half. <clears throat> okay. So that wasn't bad. As for the soft jellies, oop, and I dropped one on the floor. I don't think I'm gonna take it, only because I'm literally about to drink cranberry juice. So I'm like, why do I need cranberry overload today? <laughs> I don't, or maybe I'll just take one. I'll just take one. I won't take both. All right, I hope y'all not looking at the back of my leg because if you're looking at the back of my wig, you need to mind your business, okay? Mind your, mind your business, okay? 
So vitamins are taken. I only took one of these today because I'm about to drink cranberry juice. I don't need all of that cranberry tonight. Um, so yeah, hopefully I can continue to, you know, take my vitamins and be, be a healthy girl. We love a healthy girl. <laughs> so I got some M&Ms that I just took from my mom. <laughs> I'm going to eat these. I got my cranberry juice, got my water. I'm probably gonna snack on these little animal crackers. Yeah, I'll be stealing everybody's snacks at my house. Like, if I see something and nobody looking, I'm taking it and I'm running to my room. And it's it's gone. It's a goner. So, I might just snack. I don't think I'm gonna cook like a big dinner tonight or nothing like that because I'm just like kind of full off of that tuna. So, I'm glad I didn't like put that potato in the oven. So, for dinner, I think I'm just gonna make. A smoothie all right y'all so it's later on it's like 10 25 I just made a smoothie so I'm gonna fix my camera I just made a smoothie I put banana um, blueberries and I put strawberries in it um, and it's so good so I drink this mm. And that's gonna be like my dinner. I just wanna come in here and tell y'all that. I don't know why. I was debating on if I was gonna end a vlog off tonight or if I was gonna still vlog tomorrow because I want this vlog to go up tomorrow. So I don't know if I'm gonna still vlog tomorrow and like edit in the same day. Mm, I don't know. But definitely about to get in my bed. I've just been chilling. Watching Criminal Minds. About to sip my smoothie and go to sleep. Because there's literally nothing else to do. That's all I do. Is be home. In my bed. At least my nails are cute. Yeah, I see ya. Focus, yes. I fixed the settings on my camera. So, like, my camera is focusing way better now. And it's crazy how it literally took almost two years for me to finally figure it out but y'all see how it's like focusing 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 that's what i'm talking about so i think i fixed it and make sure y'all follow me on tiktok because i'm gonna be posting on tiktok more often i was posting on it a lot over the summer and i grew like six thousand followers in like a month which is crazy then like I fell off and like I stopped posting so like I'm just trying to become consistent again and hopefully hit like 10k um by like February oh yeah criminal minds be good like see you will never catch me lacking because I watch too much of this shit so <laughs> anyways y'all let me get off of here because I'm literally rambling and I should just be talking for so long oh my lashes though so cute this is um 14s i think yeah these are 14s c curl i'll link my lashes down below if y'all want to get them i get my lashes from amazon i'll be buying like five packs of lashes like today i bought like five packs because i like to just get them in bulk and they're like five dollars each so they're like cheap so yeah i love lashes though like i feel like i just have to have lashes on now and it's crazy because it's like once you start wearing lash extensions, you can never stop. So, I'm warning you now. If you think you want to start wearing lash extensions, just make sure you're ready to always wear them 24-7. Because it's like you're not going to like not want to wear them. Like, it's like an addiction. Like, you feel like you like need them. And it's crazy. So, <laughs> I was trying to figure out if I was going to order the big size of the... Fenty Beauty, um, Fenty Skin Body Butter because I was telling y'all earlier that I really, really love it. And I got the mini size just to like try it out because I think Sephora had a 20% off sale. Which is really when I should have got it. <sighs> but that's when I ended up buying the mini one. So I think I'm going to go in here and see if I want it or not. So I don't know. Excuse me. 
I really want to try that Tatcha. That Tatcha eye cream and like skincare. I heard it's so good. Yeah, I just need to stop spending my money. But then at the same time, like, I spend money, but like, I don't. Like, I feel like you should definitely treat yourself once in a while because. You know what I'm saying? We work hard, so why not enjoy nice things if we working hard for it? Like, I really want to try that touch of skincare. What is this? The rice wash. It's the cleanser and the cream. Not as out of stock. Y'all is just so ugh. Why is y'all playing with me? How is it out of stock already? Oh right, yeah, I'm on Sephora right now, so let's see if they got the Fenty Skin. That Fenty Skin Body Butter, because Rihanna, you gonna have me in a chokehold with that one. Rihanna is so beautiful, like, how are you that beautiful? Her skin is so freaking gorgeous. Okay. So I have this one is the 2.5 ounce. It's literally like super small. And then they have the 6.7 ounce, which is this big one right here. And I want this big one. Look, it's a it's a big size. Y'all see that? So I don't know. Why do we, why would they do this? So the original container is thirty nine dollars, and if you already have the container and you just want the refill, it's thirty five dollars. But it's literally a four dollar difference. So it's like at that point, why am I gonna go through all of that just to just to um just to do that? Like at that point, I will literally just be the person that buys the refill and just not have a top to it. <laughs> Because you could save yourself four dollars, but like I'm not gonna do that. And they got Klarna. Yeah, don't tell me that, cause I'm quick to do Klarna, baby. Yeah, yeah. So, oh, and I have like some rewards on my thing. So yeah, I think I'm gonna buy this now. Hey y'all. So it's the next day. Uh, just got back home because I had to take my mom somewhere. But my package from Victoria's Secret finally came. So I guess I'm going to show y'all what I bought. Let me put my glasses on because I look a little raggedy right now. And I don't like it. Alright. So I ordered some like body care and stuff off of Victoria's Secret. Like, how long ago? Maybe like a week ago or something. So here it is. And at first I didn't even know what it was. I guess they changed their logo. Because the logo looks like this. And I was looking like, what the hell is that? Like, whatever. So. Got a few items. Let me take it all out the box. I don't even remember what I bought. Oh, I bought a cocoa lotion, hydrating body lotion, cocoa oil, and the body butter. And they were like $6 each. So I was like, that's a good deal. Because they like regular... 18 20 dollars and stuff so they had a little holiday sale so, oh but this is small so this is the body butter that i got yeah i know i love a good body butter like i love just lathering my body and like different stuff oh that smells good and it's very thick and creamy creamy wow look at that y'all see how creamy that is 
Mm, it feels really nice. So since it's like a this is like a cheaper body butter, this isn't something that I'll feel bad like using a lot of. Cause y'all know I ordered my Fenty last night, the big one, and that big one was forty dollars. So like I don't want to use that all the time. Just on like you know special occasions or if I just want to give my body that extra TLC. Okay. So now what's this? I got the oh, I got the body oil as well. And it just looks like this. I think I'm gonna use this stuff today. Let's see what it's giving. I'm gonna do like a little self-care day. How are you open it? Oh. Okay. Real nice. Smells really good. It's very light and like silky. It's thin. It's not like a heavy oil or nothing like that. That's gonna make you feel like greasy or nothing. And I like that. And it's coconut oil. And then the last thing I got, I think I got the lotion as well. Yeah, I just got the lotion. So I got the lotion the oil and the butter but anyways y'all i'm gonna go ahead and end out today's vlog i really do hope you guys did enjoy this weekend vlog i'm gonna start editing it so i can try to post it up for tonight i love you guys so 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 much please leave me a like comment subscribe let me know what y'all doing for christmas christmas is literally like six days away so definitely comment down below let me know what y'all doing for christmas what you want for christmas what's on your christmas wish list or um if you bought anything from like holiday sales or deals or anything online or in store definitely comment down below and let me know what y'all bought or like any of your favorite body care products right now because i'm definitely open to trying a whole bunch of new things i really hope y'all did enjoy this video make sure y'all follow me on instagram snapchat twitter all of that tiktok is in my description box down below i love you guys so much and i will see you in my next video peace